American journalist Peter Theo Curtis has returned home to the United States two days after being freed by a Syrian extremist group. A statement released by a family member late Tuesday says 45-year-old Curtis arrived at Newark Liberty International Airport Tuesday afternoon after leaving Tel Aviv. He was later reunited with his mother Nancy Curtis at Boston Logan International Airport. His father, who lives in France, said he was overjoyed when his son was released. I mean, you can imagine, you, know, you don't want to have your son a prisoner someplace where you can't communicate with him and you don't know what's going on and it's just, nothing is happening that you can, you know, it's terrible. It's terrible, it's terrible, it's a terrible thing to have. I felt as if there was a, a huge weight lifted from my shoulders. Curtis says he's deeply indebted to U.S. officials who worked to get him released. Bob McCall, Associated Press.